beauty surrounds us all in nature. However, with a little man's effort, beauty can be enhanced. In Maseno, birds chirp, trees sway, and people converse. Lying along the equator, Maseno University has maintained a blend of natural and exotic tree species, giving itself a beautiful environment. We, we are under equatorial climate, and one of the character, characteristics of equatorial climate is tropical rainforest, which we can see around here. And because of that kind of a climate, Maseno is relatively cool. This air which you breathe here, it is fresh. The trees provide scenic routes, shade for students' discussions or relaxation, and the much-needed fresh air. You have experienced that the agroforestry trees, they have no effect with the, with the soil, in such a way that they don't consume a lot of water. And then the other thing, uh, they create the good canopy to the environment, and then the other importance, they produce some good, uh, good uh, farmyard manure, those leaves by dropping in the chamber. Where we are here, there is a tree nursery. These are the, the seedlings. And this tree nursery has really supported the afforestation in Maseno and the areas which, which is around Maseno. So many people, they come here to buy these trees. And even the Maseno University areas which require reforestation, they normally use this, the seedling from this place. Maseno is geographically located in a, a, a place with diverse species. And uh, the question that we have raised before and we are raising now is about how should the university benefit from the biological diversity around the university. We are taking stock of the various types of uh, biological diversity, the various types of trees, the herbs, the fruits, indigenous fruits, uh, trees or materials that have been used for, for making uh, music, because we also have in Maseno a department of music. But it's not only the trees that contribute to this beauty. A stream meanders across the river campus and a dam lies adjacent to the forest of trees. Maseno University is evergreen thanks to ample rainfall even in the driest month, creating a suitable environment for agriculture and sports. The weather is very conducive. Um, as you can see, it's, uh, it's, always, it's always rainy throughout the season. So, me being a rugby player, it's very, it's, it's very conducive because the grass grows throughout the year. There's, there's, there isn't a dry season. So, for us, for rugby guys, um, on the pitch is very dry. We get lots of injuries, as in grass burns, you know. Uh, we are in uh, a university which is offering agriculture and food security, which is a very important aspect in human life. And we must say that uh, for this, we are seeing that the search for biological diversity will help us in uh, bringing up some of the disappearing indigenous vegetables, which need to be uh, recouped so that we can grow them and make people benefit from them. Located on the shores of Lake Victoria, Maseno University is accessible by water, air, and road. What's really interesting about Maseno University is its position on the equator. The imaginary line divides the university into two. Hence, it is possible to study in the northern hemisphere and retire to a hostel in the south. Usually when there is environmental degradation or destruction, it is because people don't know what they are losing by destroying what is available. And we are saying 
there's so much in the environment that should be protected for the benefit of humanity and other living organisms. As the world grapples with environmental challenges, at Maseno, we are green. We can only urge the world to emulate Maseno so that we may have a world that was made for us. <laughs>